Hello, welcome back to the Lizzo Wellbeing YouTube channel and my last message just before Christmas. I hope everybody is surviving and maybe even thriving with some of the wellness wisdom gathered here. It's been an amazing year. Thank you so much for being part of it. We've covered so much. It's been incredible. Everything from collagen to kombucha, acupressure to quercetin and so much more besides. I've learned a lot and I've really enjoyed it. And I've loved so many of the experts I've had a chance to talk to on social media and of course also on my podcast, The Lizard Wellbeing Show. Lots there to listen to actually over Christmas if you fancy it. So now the festivities are kind of beginning, beginning to unwind, wrap presents, do all of that. I've got my family here for Christmas, so it's just gonna be a quiet, cozy family time, really special, actually. I've got all my children, my five kids are all here. Even my eldest, my eldest boy is coming back from Kenya. So looking forward to that. Christmas Eve is going to be quite chilled. Traditionally, you eat fish on Christmas Eve here in the UK. So I've made a big fish pie, that's already in the freezer. So I'll be pulling that out. And then we'll hang up stockings. Have we been good enough? I don't know, we'll see, maybe, we'll follow Christmas come. Little well-being treats maybe in the stockings, we'll see. Uh, Christmas morning, I have actually said that everybody who stays with me has to come for a cold dip, first thing. Not quite sure how that's gonna go down. So we'll see, if we do manage it, I will put a picture on my Instagram, Lizelle Me, so you can check that and see whether they all made it. So that'll be first thing, hopefully. Then we'll head to our local little village church for Christmas service, then come back for mince pies, maybe some mulled wine. I might do some mulled apple juice with cinnamon and star anise, something really simple. And then Christmas lunch. So for us, it's traditional roast turkey, sprouts, pigs in blankets, gravy, red cabbage, all of that. And then, of course, we've got the King's Speech, haven't we? Gosh, it sounds a bit weird saying that, the King's Speech, after all these years. Obviously, like many of us watching, I've only ever had the Queen's Speech. So I wonder how that's going to go. So looking forward to it all. What about you? What are your plans? Drop me a comment below. Love to hear. Love to share. But most of all, thank you for being with us. My team and I are hugely grateful for your support. It's a lovely community. We've so enjoyed connecting with you here on YouTube, but obviously across Instagram and Facebook and Twitter and all the usual platforms. So thank you, big, big hearts. There's not gonna be any YouTube next week, taking next week off to be with the fam, but I will be back in the new year. We've got some fantastic things planned for the new year. We've got a new look for the magazine. It's kind of a mini launch, new launch. So I'd love to know what you hear. I hope you've got your subscription. We've got so many good things planned for the year ahead, stepping into 2023. But until then, I wish you a really happy, happy Christmas, a wonderful new year, and I'll see you the other side, 2023. Bye.